Hello everyone, welcome back to some more Ratchet Deadlock. My name is Sin K, call me Sin for short. Uh, I'll give a brief recap. We just finished a planet, a, an, an unbeatable planet apparently, <laughs> called Ghost Town. Uh, we did that. Uh, we, it was very fucking pretty, you know, a little bit difficult. Some of the sections were a bit long, but overall the music, mwah, phenomenal, all right? Just, ah, oh, chef's kiss. And now we are here to get rid of Vox. And that is it. That is where we're at. And we're gonna go jump right back into it. So let's go. Let's go kick some ass. Let's fucking get into it. Oh, here it is. I'm stupid. Oh, fuck. Yes. Let's go. Oh shit, we took it over. Clank, come in. Can you hear me? Something just doesn't seem right here. Not good. Well, well, well. What have we here, Dreadzone fans? A contestant attempting to sabotage the Battle Dome? How exciting! If he succeeds, the rest of the contestants go free! But if he fails, I've wired the Battle Dome with six gigatons of nitroglycerin. If no Ratchet way. doesn't disarm the detonator before time runs out, the Battle Dome will be blown into a trillion pieces! That's insane! Au contraire. If I was still on the Battle Dome, then it would be insane. But I happen to have a truly lovely view of the action from a remote location. What about the thousands of fans in the Battle Dome? You gonna kill all of them, too? Of course not! You are! Unless you shut your cake hole and get moving. Come on now! Your audience is waiting. <laughs> wow, what an asshole. And gentlemen, and <gasps> welcome to, uh, He's got cars on him! Final episode of Dread Zone. Oh, God. We're all gonna die. Uh, um, the mood is positively... Electric as the audience braces to find out if they will survive the next 10 minutes. I can't believe I'm reading this. I had my whole life ahead of me. I was gonna be a ballet dancer. Pull yourself together, you blabbering idiot! Thank you, Juanita. Oh my Superstar god. Superstar contestant Ratchet faces his toughest challenge yet to deactivate the Battle Dome's formidable defense systems and defeat Gleeman Vox himself. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank Ratchet for being such a great role model and a pillar of our community. If anybody can save us, it's you, Ratchet. We're rooting for you, little buddy. Oh my God! There's a I fucking so time sorry, limit. Ratchet. I did not realize I was leading you into another one of Vox's traps. There is still a way out, though. If you can destroy the three fusion generators on the control level, no it way. will release the escape shuttles, and both the fans and the heroes will be saved. Get up, you stupid bot. I'm on it. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I don't have time. We really don't have time, motherfucker. We just gotta keep moving. Ratchet, the station will be blown to bits any moment. Please hurry. No! Oh man, this is gonna take much longer. Ratchet, the station will be blown to bits any moment. Please hurry. I'm going, Clank. I'm going. Oh shit, what's going on? Why isn't the door opening? Oh fuck, I'm stupid, I wasn't paying attention. Security launch activated, sir! Ready for your next order! Come on. Oh, 
fuck everything, man. We're just going. We just gotta keep going, man. Come on, Ratchet, you can do it. If you can't, we'll all die. Chill out, man. You're making me nervous. We need them done. We need them all done, bro. That's what I was trained for, sir. Yes, drill sergeant. Excellent, Ratchet. Oh, my God. Now, deactivate the second generator. But hurry, time is running out. Oh, fuck. That took me three minutes. Shit. Oh good, time Just resets. On a solemn episode of Dread Zone. Everybody dies! Oh no! Dallas, you're embarrassing yourself. <laughs> Mommy, I don't want to go bye-bye. Dallas, this is not the time! Oh, baby. You're a baby. Good baby. Baby, no cry. What am I fucking hearing? Did you guys just hear that? What the fuck was that? Was she comforting him? Why? Why? Oh, not me! I'm too pretty to die! You uh -huh. won't, Dallas. No straight turn up! Look at you, crying on Galaxy Wide Hollow Vision. You are a selfish, selfish man! Thank you, Juanita! Your searing dose of verbal abuse was refreshing. I can't even tell you. Oh, and the whole mommy baby thing. Mmm, sexy. Baby needs Boy. a changing. <laughs> baby needs a changing. <laughs> Bro, what is this man? <laughs> He's down bad. He is down bad. Ratchet, you are running out of time. The generators are overloading. Stop it, Blank. You're freaking me out. So much pressure, bro. So much pressure. Get out of my way. What the hell? Oh, I didn't see it last second. Oh, no. Several escape shuttles are leaving the battle dome. Keep working, Ratchet. Stop it. We're just running. No way he hit me though. Okay. Dude, I didn't know they were both down. No, please. Oh, 
Come on, bro. I'm struggling. Yes, is that the last one? No, there's one more. Oh, I did it. Oh my God. That almost took us a whole four minutes. Jesus. I suppose since we're all about to perish horribly, I should own up to a few things. First of all, Timmy Aberdeen, I'm the one who set your backpack on fire. I'm sorry you couldn't get it off in time. No way. He's confessing? Dude, and we're gonna Susie live. Mickelson, I was the one who put the tyranoid in your locker. Hey, I heard the therapy is going well, though. Chin up, kid! He's a horrible person, though. No shot that hit me. And finally to you, Juanita, my dear, sweet Juanita. I apologize for the last six years of rude jokes, harassing innuendo, and all those friendly little pinches in the elevator. But who are we kidding? You love it! Oh my god. He's got a... <laughs> he's got a really bad... <laughs> oh, dude. He's got a bad crush on her. When I mean bad, like bad, bad. Like, he's Ratchet, terrible. Can you pick up the pace, please? The station is seconds away from exploding. Well, Clank, it'd be easier if you just didn't put any more pressure on me, you know? I'm trying my best. Alright, 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 right. There's about to be a shitload of fucking... Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, come on. See that? I thought about it. No shot I got hit with that. I was panicking. Just keep going, just keep going. What do you do when you go? No, no, no! Oh! Thought ice would be better because it like freezes them and stuff. I will catch up. Okay, this time I'm back here and I have a hollow fucking shield. I'm gonna chuck these fucking turrets right off the bat. There we go. Alright, alright. This time we got this. We got this. Next one. No way it's this easy. Usually there's like resistance. Bro, no way. Nobody's spawning in. Is this some kind of glitch or something? What's going on? Somebody pulling my leg here? Where the fuck's the enemy? What the fuck? Okay, I guess that was easy. That took a lot. That probably took me like five to six minutes. God damn. Well done, Ratchet. The containment fields are deactivated. The station is no longer on lockdown. Good. Now get on a shuttle and get out of here. Sorry, Ratchet. I am not leaving without you. For the love of blog, cut out the sappy melodrama before you lose my entire audience. <laughs> I've been waiting for this moment for a long no time. No way. I'm gonna give Dread Zone fans the finale they've been waiting for. It's a little one-act play I call Death of the Lombats. <laughs> No fucking shot. We get the fight. Parental fight. discretion is strongly advised. Oh fuck! Oh, looks 
like Box has some tricks up his sleeve. This is gonna be one heck of a match. Considering that we die if Teen Darkstar loses, that's an understatement. An understatement, an undergarment, the underworld of professional mustache twirling, whatever it is, it's hot! Folks, I'm gonna break character for just a second and say, Watch out! If you don't, we all die! <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, Lunchbox, eat this! What is it? Oh, no! This could mean disaster for Team Darkstar! I put 500 bolts on this match! What is it? Dallas, our lives hang in the balance, and you are gambling? Oh, don't pretend like you care. You never cared! Oh, oh, there we go! I popped a blood vessel again! Oh, all right, can somebody get me a tissue? Here's a third act twist. The big bad guy just got bigger. No way. This year on Drexel, an audience favorite, the giant mech climactic battle. Please die. I can't look. His team dogs are dead. Oh, Dallas, shit. What's happening? Jealous, what are you doing? Nothing, just keep your eyes closed. Now! Oh! Time to pump up the action. Please. That's right. Take him out, Team Darkstar! Destroy Yes! Him. Destroy his body! Yes! Make him cry. First try, motherfuckers. <laughs> it's over, Vox. No. <laughs> But it will be soon. Destruct sequence initiated. 60 seconds until Battle Dome detonation. The escape shuttles all left long ago. <laughs> now we'll both die together on live Holovision. <laughs> It'll be the best ratings I've ever had. Even if I don't make it out of here alive, at least a lot of other heroes escape tonight. <laughs> Oh my Enjoy god. Enjoy your pathetic idealism <laughs> for the last few seconds of your life. That clank? I knew it. What? Get in, Ratchet. There is no time remaining. Just a sec. <laughs> Hold still, Ratchet. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> Check out that explosion! That was awesome! <laughs> Let's do it again! Move! It's my turn to look! No, it's my turn, you little brats! Get out of here! Don't you know how to respect your elders, hmm? <laughs> Ow! Did you see what she just- ah! Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> what? If this was the last shuttle, what else could I do? Hey, I think oh, wow. we're going. We've got incoming calls. Ratchet, Clank. Hey, it's Kid Nova. What can I say? I thought I was a goner back there. I owe you guys big time. Hey, Ratchet. It's Hydra Girl. If you're ever back in Aquatos, promise you look me up, okay? Ah, well, uh, Aquatos is nice this time of year. Well, why not? Oh my god. Calls coming in. Ratchet, Glank, it's me, Captain Quark. There's a nasty rumor. There he is. Heroes being kidnapped, but don't worry. It's baloney. I mean, come on. Nobody came to capture me, right? Just imagine making a show oh about galactic heroes without Captain Quark. <laughs> well, anyway, you guys missed the last three meetings of the Quark Cadets fan club. Oh my oh, fucking god. I've got extra copies of the newsletter and I even saved some of the snacks. Hope you like custard. I was wondering where he was and when he was gonna show up. No way, that was good. That was actually a really good ending. Wow. Thank you everyone that has joined me on this journey of for Ratchet Deadlock. We're going to continue right along with the next game. I believe the next game is called uh, Ratchet and Clank Future Tools of Destruction, if I'm correct. We're going to go straight into that game immediately the next day after this goes up. I think. I'm not, I'm not sure when this comes out. If it's not tomorrow, then it's next week. All right. 
I, I have to still edit all the episodes. So if you guys see this, then, you know, I apologize if I said tomorrow. Overall, I really love this game. My overall thoughts is that the customization for the guns was amazing. The combinations, the way you could throw things around, uh, the customization of the robots and seeing the suit change was awesome. The only thing I didn't like is that there wasn't enough platforming, but that kind of like made me forget about it because then the gunplay showed up and really like took control of everything. I really loved the gun, the gunplay. I, overall, also the, the loading screens, there was a lot of loading screens. I don't know if you guys noticed, but there was tons of loading screens because I guess they had to do all these levels in batches or save time or something. I don't know, but that, that was also a big discouragement for me. But overall, what outshined it was the music, the graphics, all that stuff just really outshined it all. Overall, real solid game. I would replay this if, you know, if I was a kid back then, I would replay this a lot. I am going to replay this all the series all over again, and I am going to get all the collectibles. Anyways, tell me your, what was your favorite part throughout this game. My favorite part throughout the game was probably the snow level. I know, right? Shocker. But that, the snow level was really a good solid level for me. I did not hate it for once. I hate snow levels. I hate anything with water and snow. Just because there's that trope that there, you have to either drown or go underwater or you slip and slide on ice and icicles and stuff like that. I don't, I don't like that stuff. It just... It's annoying to me and it's tedious and I just don't like it. I, I learned my lesson with Crash Bandicoot, Spyro. Uh, there's a few others that I, I can't name off the top of my head. Other games that I played that had snow and water levels and I just, just never liked them at all. Anyways, without further ado, I'll catch you guys all tomorrow or next week. And uh, good evening, good night, and good morning. If you know where that's from and I kind of butchered it, that's fine. <laughs> Anyways, love you guys. I'll catch you guys all later. And without further ado, bye-bye. Smell you later. Eat your socks. Eat some pie. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. we were coming within range of a space station! Well, we were, sir. How was I to know it would suddenly explode? Lawrence! Oh, Janice. It's been so long. Too long. Say you'll never leave me again for that nasty villain, Engelbert. Oh, Young boy again, what the fuck?